Okay, so guys, um, today I'm going to add another camera, uh, or a different camera, to my lawnmower. It won't be to my snowblower. I, it eventually will be, but I can't test it on my snowblower today as there is no snow. So I'm going to put this on my lawnmower. I uh, got a uh, FPV camera from uh, Fox Ear. Um, it's supposed to be a pretty nice camera. It's uh, made so that you can use uh, your uh, VR cameras. Your, I mean, sorry, your VR monitors. Um, so, and I got a Fox here external antenna on it. Um, also, I got a Tramp HV transmitter, which is supposed to be pretty good. Um, so, anyway, so that should transmit pretty decent video. Then to uh, receive it, I've got a each on. Um, it's a ROTG01 5.8 gigahertz receiver. This uh, receiver here that I got in a kind of a cool little case here. I think I paid more for the case than I did. But, but this works pretty good. What this does is this is a receiver that will receive the signal from the uh, Fox Ear transmitter. Uh, I'm sorry, the transmitter, the Tramp HV transmitter. It'll go from there, it goes into a cell phone. Now, unfortunately, my S7 won't work. I'm not sure why. Online, they were saying the same thing, that using this uh, receiver, uh, a lot of the Samsung S7s and S6s won't work. But I'm not sure why, but my wife's does work. It works pretty good on hers. <clears throat> and you'll see that a little bit later. So anyway, so the receiver, and then you plug it in here, and you can see it on your cell phone or tablets, you know, iPhones, a lot of different devices. Uh, then, of course, what I've done there was I put this in here in the, in the goggles, and you can see pretty good. You'll see that later, too, but yeah, it's pretty nice. The other option that I have also was to uh, get a, pick it up on a Spectrum uh, receiver. <clears throat> now, this receiver here... Um, works pretty good, I guess. No big complaints. Uh, let me see here. The, uh, oh, come on. Um, I was a little dismayed at the quality that it was receiving. Of course, it's not receiving anything right now. It's not hooked up, but, uh, there was a little bit of static in it, and I'm not sure if that was from the camera, uh, or, you know, what, but I guess we'll see a little bit later. When I get it all hooked up, it's also got an external antenna on it, another Foxier antenna. So anyway, um, and this is the uh, battery for the camera, the Foxier uh, FPV camera. All right. So anyway, we'll see how it works. I wish me luck. Okay, so guys, here's what I've done recently. So. You already know about the standard stuff, the Sabertooth motor controller, the uh, AR610 receiver, and the uh, relay switch from robots. Okay, so what I've done now is I've added a FPV uh, camera, um, and it's actually right there. Uh, and I've got the transmitter, that's the uh, Tramp VP, I'm sorry, HV uh, transmitter. It goes on there. And uh, of course, there's the camera. I put on another antenna to help out with the uh, you know, reception. And uh, so, and I got it all together. Ready to go try it out. So, here we go. Okay, so I'm going to try out my uh, virtual reality uh, goggles on the uh, lawnmower, the robotic lawnmower that I have out there. <clears throat> so, here goes nothing. And this is cool. <laughs> All right. Okay, so now I have it set up so you can see it without the goggles because I, I can't film it on the goggles, so I have it set up here. So here's what I've got. Uh, you can see on the uh, phone here, you can see. And uh, 
Yes, I have turned it on. And I got it going kind of slow so you can see it. And I hope you're able to see it. I don't know if you can or not, but in the goggles, it the virtual or the, in the goggles it does uh, split to two, so you can see them on the on the goggles.